EIFS Expansion Joints Presented by EIFS Repair Produced by Corey Turcotte All rights reserved The expansion joints around the windows and doors in an EIFS application should be between 5 eighths of an inch to 3 quarters of an inch on your typical residential home. On a commercial project the expansion joints can be much larger depending on materials used. The expansion joints need to be primed and filled with a closed cell backer rod. Then it is filled with an approved sealant. The sealant should always be tooled, as the caulk needs to be forced into the top coat's aggregate. It is important to note that the top coat or finish coat is not applied inside the expansion joint. The sealant bonds to the cement coat not the top coat. The expansion joint where the EIFS terminates to brick or stone should be much larger than 5 eighths of an inch. When the home settles the expansion allows for movement. There should be an expansion between levels of the house, and anywhere you are going from one substrate to another. When designing an EIFS house it is a good idea to look up the expansion joint specifications, and include the joints in your design.